So today I wanted to make a wreath. You wouldn't believe that I still have our Easter wreath on our door. Bunnies and all, eggs and all. Um, and then with COVID and everything, I just haven't found the time to go actually shopping to look for a new one. So I picked up some plants from Dollar Tree. And I wanted to try to make something that looks a little summery but can transition into fall. So wish me luck. I seen a video. I forgot the name. Hey guys, the name of the channel was Measure and Mix. I will try to leave their link in the description box. Okay. Get the sticks. So I have this glue gun that my mother-in-law gave me. It's just a mini low temp. Little glue gun. I don't do too many crafts and things yet. I'm trying to get into that. Um, let's see. And then I bought these from Target. I think they were like $3.99. So not too bad for $30. Let's get started, guys. Wish me luck. So basically what I seen her do was just kind of pop the flowers off and she hot glued them to the rod that she got from the Dollar Tree. Same one I have. And we're going to see how this works. I beg of you. Another thing, y'all, I talk to myself. I know a lot of people do it. Um, call me crazy if you want. <laughs> I don't really care. So you may hear me making comments to myself. And you may hear the kids in the background. They are playing at their table with their kinetic sand. Mariah, do not eat the sand. Spit it out. No eating sand. So at this time, um, after I told my daughter to stop eating sand, <laughs> I just started trying to apply um, some of the petals to the wreath. Um, it was a little difficult because you kind of have to strategically place them to where they will, the glue will adhere to that um, rod wreath. Um, so just kind of take your time, make sure you're placing it correctly and everything. Um, and you should get a pretty good hold. Uh, I noticed too, sometimes when you added glue towards the back of it, just to secure, it did help a lot. We have bunnies on our door. We need a new ring. This has to work. Okay. <laughs> uh, so what I have, y'all. I also have been trying to get more into my faith with all this that's been going on too. So if anybody knows of any like good Bibles, study Bibles, you know, uh, what you suggest, like I said, I just want to get a better understanding of my faith um, that I kind of had, but just as an adult, a better understanding of what's going on now and, and just everything. If you're getting somewhere, I'm going to tear my nails up before I'm done with it though. Hopefully not. Okay. Okay. So we're getting somewhere. At this point, I'm probably just going to start speeding up and then I'll bring it back for you guys to see, but I'm doing okay. <laughs> which I am loving. I think it turned out really, really well. Let me know what you guys think, suggestions. I'm all for it. Um, let's go hang it on our front door. So we like if you liked it. Um, subscribe. Wouldn't hurt now, okay? <laughs> but no, for real. Just tell me, guys, what you think. Bye-bye, bunny. Bye -bye, bunny. <laughs> See?
Not too bad. Let's see it from outside. Oh, 